great, Stephen. Very good. Laura? Hi, my name is Laura, and I'm a thief. Hi, Laura. I've been stealing from my coworkers for only four months. It's a bad thing, I know, but they don't deserve the things they have. I work twice as hard as they do, but they still get more than the lion's share in computer upgrades and freebies like that. I thought stealing from them was a way to even the playing field in the office. But I realize now wait, wait, that- Wait, 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 how'd you do it? What, I'm sorry, what? No, that's genius. I mean, you can score so much free office supplies that way. Well, yeah, I, I, I suppose it is. I suppose you had access to the fundamentals of life. Pens, pencils, paper clips, scotch tape. I mean, why bother buying it when you can borrow it? Please, please, Adam. This is working backwards, yeah? So let's let Laura finish, and then you can wait for your turn. Well, I found out that they keep a cash stash underneath the water cooler for beer on Friday, which they're not supposed to bring into the office, first of all. They never knew who was taking Laura, it. Laura, let's hear about what you were about to say, what you realized, yeah? Oh, well, I realized that I didn't need to steal because my hard work and persistence showed my boss recently offered me a raise, and I really feel like I'm slowly but surely climbing the company ladder. That oh, was very good, Laura. Excellent. Chat. Hi, my name is Chet, and I am a thief. Hi, Hi Chet! Hi. Well, uh, I've been stealing for as long as I can remember um, from people I know and don't know. I got the keys. <laughs> it, it's been a battle at times, you know. Uh, I've struggled to overcome it, but it's just that stealing has been such a large part of my life for so long, and I have absolutely no intention of stopping. Chet, you're in the company of friends. Be strong. Tell us what you really feel. Remember, you're not alone. No. Listen, sweetie, the thing is, what you're doing for these people here? It's great, and I totally respect that. However, everyone has their vices, and for me, I think it's healthy to express myself through the art of stealing from those that are a bit more fortunate than I am. Okay, everyone, I think it's time to rebalance our chakra and make our third eye look inward. Hold hands, yes? So, all right, now close your eyes and concentrate, and let's really feel the spiritual energy passing through our body. Yes. I really feel this. Yes. Excellent. This is good. My third eye. It's wide open. Yes. Great. This is great. You know the Dalai Lama was self-actualized when he reached your age. Chet, you are obviously not taking your spiritual health seriously. If you are not going to take care of yourself, we are certainly not going to take care of you. What, you guys are really buying into this? This balancing of the chakras, this spiritual healing? What, are we going to drop some acid? Chet, I'm going to have to ask you to leave. But what if I, what if I want to heal my spiritual energy? Worth it? No? No. Hey, 
Were you serious back there? What? Uh, I like what I saw. Yeah, yeah, no, yeah, we're all about it. Yeah, you're all about that? Uh, totally, but, uh, what's it to you? Where are you? What? They're my friends? Would you look at these guys? They could barely take down a... Okay, where the hell are you? Well, if it isn't classy lady, Jackie, and two fine gentlemen. Fun? Hmm, only if you make mine as flashy as yours. Just give me the freaking phone. Show me mine and I'll show you yours. Your handiwork's not bad. If you'd like to see some more, give me a call sometime. If you're lucky. Uh, hello. We're still here, and who the hell are you, man? The name is Flip. Well, listen, gents, this is a one-on-one -on -one conversation. You know what? You remind me of Arthur Fonzarelli. Fonz, uh... Yeah, dude, the Fonz! Listen, I'm not even from this country, and I know the Fonz. Happy Days was one of the happiest parts of my childhood. You know? Sunday, Friday, smiley day. Tuesday, Thursday, smiley day. Yeah, that's it. I used to have a Fonz lunchbox when I was a little kid. I was crushing it in my mom threw it out. Well, you know, I know a guy, and I can have it to you by next week. Well, I know a guy, and I can get it to you by Wednesday. <laughs> Tuesday. Monday. Sunday. <laughs> Tomorrow. <clears throat> Today truly is a happy day, gentlemen. <laughs> <laughs>